All right, there's an intro that's gonna come after this because I don't know how I can explain what just happened today and it's only lunchtime. Like, you know, I'm a YouTuber, I ham stuff up. But this is crazy. It's gonna be a long video and I apologize. I could break it up into little ones, but I'm just gonna let it roll and later on I'll go and put the timestamps in for when stuff goes really, really bad. Every car that went through this got some sort of damage. It was epic. Land Cruiser Canyon. I don't know how Land Cruisers get there. We punched, I don't know, eight patrols through there today. I'm gonna stop. You have to look at the morning, which was hectic. And then you can have a look at Land Cruiser Canyon. But now you can see my intro for the morning and then get onto it. But this, this is the most hectic stuff I've ever done or filmed. What an epic day one that was. Uh, now we're waking up to day two. I'm gonna go around and do a bit of a count soon to see how many Y62s are here because I swear this is some sort of a record. I've never seen so many Y62s in one place. We've got more Y62s than this and having all of their dealerships. Oh, here he is, morning. <laughs> You, you put on a good feast uh, last night. Uh, yeah, apparently I did. It was, was good. There's some rave reviews. I will cut to what happened last night. <laughs> if I don't eat my dinner, I'm going to be in trouble with the missus. <laughs> you break. Look, he's doing it again. What are we cooking? Uh, I've got two full sides of um, rice sauce. Yum. Uh, we're doing the... Uh, Michael from Method Race Wheels. Oh, is this it? Kindly, is it? kindly donated a couple of big racks. They look like Scotch fillets. Well, yeah. High fillets. Well, yeah. Same thing. There we go. I'm a little bit stupid. What does it say? Sunday Creek Premium Beef. You know what? Not very clever, no. It's um, it's like a Scotch. It's just an eye fillet. No bone. Ribeye, no bone. You know Sharon's cooking me dinner up there. Yeah, and? Oh, so... Every other time when Sharon cooks your dinner and I've got leftovers, oh, you don't eat any, do you? No. No, never. No. Oh, shit, Dave. <laughs> I've only got... Look, there's only so much stomach. Bullshit, Dave. I'm going to make some choices. Bullshit, Dave. Eat. Uh, I'll eat Sharon's food so you don't end up in the doghouse and then come like a, like a sly little fox around the back. <laughs> Do it. So we have to thank um, Mike from Method, yeah? Yeah, Michael. Michael Taylor. Michael from Method. Yeah. He's putting on the meat for Off-Road Tavern. And then, uh, what's that called, David? Bruschetta? Bruschetta. <laughs> when you say a big plug, do you mean like in the toilets tomorrow? Or? <laughs> You're a dick. <laughs> All right, I'm looking forward to this. And um, yes, I am very full now. What have you got in your hand there? Mr. Patterson has organized a barista in the bush. Like Barry the Bush Barrier, but a barista in the bush. <laughs> it rhymes. I think it's a bit different to Barry. I've got my, I have a double latte with almond milk because it says George. <laughs> I know. It's just age. Barry did come to the bush, though. Barry, he did come. He gets around, actually. He made an appearance originally. He's, oh. a Barry the ba he's actually Barry the Band-Aid. <laughs> we won't talk about why. No, we won't. Let's go check out this um, barista thing. It's down here. Like, we've been camping for days and weeks. We're all, like, smelly, dirty. Then these guys rock up. It's looking bloody... All perfect. Here we go. Actually, I'm going to spin the camera around. Look at this. So we've got an order from like a camp up the top. Okay. We've got an order from a camp up the top here. They're a bunch of hippies. Okay. They want a vanilla choc macadamia latte decaf <laughs> with almond milk and one uh, dextrose, please. All right, down there. Okay, all right. Can do. I like the attitude, can do. <laughs> you 
guys are lucky. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Who has a blue one? Go. You're welcome. Alright, I've finished my vanilla hot macadamia at latte decaf with uh, dextrose. So uh, we're going to get back to the count. I want to know if we've set a record of the amount of Y62s in one place at a time. So I'm going to go up the front and I'm going to, I won't video it all, I'll just go front to back and um, I'll show you the other bar that's set up at the other end of camp. It's called the Predator Bar. <laughs> Alright, here we go. One. So this is patrol number 22. There's actually another one that's just gone and done a shop run. So I'm gonna call 23, that's Andrew Harlan's. 23 patrols so far, might still be more, I don't know. But um, I reckon there's a whole heap of other cars rocked up. There'd be another 20 other cars, Land Cruisers, Challengers, or oh, no, the Tuners. Everything you can think of. I'm going to show you this too. I'm coming to check out your bar. Oh, what are you smoking? Breakfast. Bacon and eggs. Holy shamoly. This is a campsite and a half. Far out. All right. I like the, the name of your bar, by the way. <laughs> it's the only That's all you can afford. Can afford <laughs> and even the symbol. Look at that. That's cool. <laughs> What a spot. This is what we're looking out over here. Gorgeous. Here we go, we're in the cars. It's Y62 traffic jam once again. Uh, I'll show you what I mean. It's all full on. I believe today we're going up air locker. Got a Harrop blocker. Hope, hope I'm still allowed to go up there. But we're doing that and not test track, test something else. But you know, with this many cars, I'm sure it'll be good. Look at them all. So more have rocked up now, too. Um, like the guys from uh, Slacks Creek on track are here. They just rolled up this morning. Man, there's every make now. It's not just 62s. Like, there's Land Cruisers. Navaras, Jeeps, Suzuki's. I'm not sure how this turned into like a free-for-all, but you know, it's all good, all good people. to say there's a few cars here. Something's going on because everyone's got out. Let's go see.
really don't know how this is going to play out. There's 40 something cars. There's more cars behind all of those cars that you can see still coming up. We can't all do this, surely. Got some no, advanced winching going on here. The old carbon winch is about to get a workout. I think this is called the slingshot maneuver. So we've got a car behind. George's car is winching up to this tree, putting a pulley on it, um, extension strap, and then down to the car. So this is how you can winch a car behind you. Well, with the winch behind you, but winch the car forward. I don't know if that made sense. Couldn't get it all on camera. 
because there's too much going on. Oh, in the corner. Um, yeah, there was winching, there was cars sliding, there was oh, bad cameramans. Um, there's stuff going on everywhere. So anyway, we, we kind of split the crew up to essentially 35s, bar work all round, and pretty much twin lock this crew looking forward and backwards to go do uh, Cruiser Canyon. I don't actually know what it's like, but the fact that Luke is saying only come if you've got those ingredients on your car, it's probably gonna be pretty hairy. So all the other guys are um, going to the start and they'll watch us take off into Cruiser Canyon and then they're gonna boot it around on the green road um, and watch us come out of it, if we come out.
I need you to stay right out of the way, please, sweetheart.
<laughs> okay. Sam, right out the way, mate.
it say? Is your car overheating a bit? Because ours is. Yeah. Yeah. What were we thinking? <laughs> oh my god, your rear bar's hanging off. I cannot believe we drove this. I haven't looked at my car yet. <laughs> yeah. After I have a beer, I have a look.
I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not good. <laughs> Which part, David? All of it. What do you want me to say? I've got sliders. And good luck. Robbie yeah. Razzler. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you better start folding another setup. Just waiting for you. I don't think I'm high enough, David, to be honest with you. Nah, they've built the road up, so like that's they fixed that part. The first guys didn't get the road building. Yep, yep. Um, so now it's actually it's how the rocks V out to the top. Yeah. Like now you're higher with the road building. Yeah, so it's you actually can clear a little bit. You're not rubbing up. Yeah, it. it's a lot safer than what it was for the first pause. The pool. migrating. Yeah. <laughs> Still got quite a few cars to come through here. Straight up the guts. George. Jesse, can Pretty well, actually, George. Well, I, well, I hit my car. Yeah. Go for these guys here. Thank you. He just smashed through, like, right? stop this. Boom. Oh, yeah, this George, from good, just keep it slow. Alright, we'll climb up. Climb it up. Front locker. Right, come this way a little bit. Hey, mate. Come to me. Come to me. Oh. 
Wow. No, I'll take the world done now. Yeah. And George, around that log, just ride it high. That's it, stay in the trench, stay in the trench. Right at the top? Right, yeah, right at high, follow those tyre tracks. Up this way? Yeah. A little bit of right end down. That's it. Yep, yeah, up there. Yeah. You got it, man. That's it, Keon. You're all right. Lift over here, I reckon. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I'm so sweaty that like I can't hold the phone, it's too slippery. I've had a beer, so I'm prepared to go and do a damage report. So let's go have a look. Steve Allen, if you're watching, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Ooh, I think, I think the sliders and the urethane actually held the rear bumper on, but that's a bit of a modification. I think we might be up for a rear bar. I think they uh, had a slider, not slider, flare relocation. <laughs> Sliders have done their job. Far out. Holy moly. This all looks all right. We'll check the other side. Let's have a look at this side. That all looks all right. I think it pressed into a rock here somewhere, but Oh yeah, here we go. I think the flare actually saved a bit of panel damage there. The sliders are banged up a bit. Considering what we just pushed these cars through, I don't think that's that bad. So, I just did a very silly thing. We just got out of all of that and we're driving back to camp and I went to go put it like back into high range but I looked down and I was in auto so I just did Land Cruiser Canyon somehow in auto like with I was playing with lockers but that's why I had such horrible throttle control and all of that but I just did that in auto oh my god